What's up guys and welcome back to another video. Today we are going to mount the BBS rims. We are also going to paint the calipers to make it look fresh. And remember, it's all about the details. So before putting the rims on, I'm going to put a light coat of Meguiar's Tech Wax on them. And now you might wonder why Meguiar's, because this wax you can put on a light coat and then just let it sit and let it dry. The more it dries, the easier it will be to polish it off. So normally when I do a car with this wax, I leave it for like 24 hours and take it off the buff it off the other day. So I'm gonna do this right now, then I'm gonna mount the wheels and when the wheels are on the car I'm gonna buff the, the wax off. So this is the first time taking off the wheels on this car for me and the last inspection on this car had noticed that there was rust on the front struts and as you can see I could easily peel away some, some paint but I think it's mostly on the surface and I have some future plans either I mount some lowering springs or I will build rebuild them with some coil over sleeves so we're just gonna add some fresh paint just wire brush them thoroughly and then add some fresh paint to it so it doesn't look this bad just add some freshness <coughs> and the same to the calipers they seem really okay in my opinion and also the brakes there are some good meat left to the pads and no really super deep edge to the brake discs so they will manage to go this season at least before I maybe upgrade them so every time I start a car build I, I figure out a theme I will go with regarding colors so this car I mean the car is blue there's nothing much you can go do about that so I have chosen to go with blue as the main color for the car I will go with a black interior and I will add the third color will be gold so I will go with gold calipers I will have some gold details to the engine bay uh, I don't know about the interior yet but there will be black almost everywhere in the interior and maybe some carbon fiber details to spice it up a bit but yeah let's get loose with the wire brush and one positive thing about this car is <coughs> it has been treated underneath with some black color 
so the whole car underneath is black which I love So now I have wire brushed everything, put some alcoholic solution on the brake calipers to clean them off and um, I have also added a very thin layer of black color, just a regular spray can. On these areas here you don't want to build up like a paint layer because this is very important to get the wheels straight to the hub or to the brake disc so just a thin layer of spray paint to make it fresh and now we will start to paint with some brake caliper paint from a Swedish store Biltema which is equivalent to uh, Harbor Freight or something like that in the US so this is pretty cheap but it works amazingly good it's easy to apply and it hardens very fast, it dries very fast and it creates a very hard surface and it withstands harsh environment. So we will start with the black and then we will move on to the gold for the calipers. painting the calipers two layers of paint on the calipers and one layer on the brake discs and the struts looking mighty fresh so let's put on the wheels and the painted lug nuts remember what I said in the beginning of the video it's all about the details cleaner than before but the wheel gaps is just insane this look doesn't satisfy my needs I'm a fitment type of guy and this 
this isn't right. The offset on these wheels are 42 and the original wheels is 41. So basically the same. I have two, 235 35 tires all the way around and uh, the wheels are 8 inches wide. I'm going to need like 20 millimeter spacer in the front and maybe maybe 30 or something in the back so it sits flush with the fender and it needs to be lowered like 40 or 50, maybe 60, like 50 millimeters, both in the front and the rear. I think it will settle a bit when I'm driving, so this is maybe the worst look, but even though the rims are looking really nice and the calipers came out super clean there's no more rust that's a big plus so I think that will be it for now so if you like this video please give it a thumbs up and I will see you soon again bye